What's up guys, it's Mr. Slynn, and today I'm doing a pub commentary. And a few of you guys in the past have told me that you really enjoyed me playing on pubs, getting really sweaty, trying my absolute hardest to crush. So I'm gonna try and do that for you today. Now I predict there are two types of people watching this video. You're either a competitive player or a filthy pub casual. If you are a competitive player, go ahead and roast me now for doing pub commentaries and getting really sweaty in pubs. Go ahead, I'll leave you some time in the comments. Go ahead and roast me. If you are a filthy casual and you wanna get better at the game, this video is for you because I'm gonna try my best as a high level competitive player to just try and crush some noobs and show you how the game is played and that way hopefully you can get better. So without further ado, we're gonna hop into the game. All right, so we are on Borneo, which is a classic payload map and I'm on the team selection screen. And when I'm looking at team selection and looking at my personal class selection, I typically choose the competitive classes because the competitive classes are the absolute best in the game. There's a reason why everyone plays them and not the more underpowered specialist classes. So when I'm looking at the team comp, I see we have two medics, a demo, zero demo man, soldier, and scout. And so typically your team will want to have a demo man. So I'll play demo man for this round. It looks like we're just about one, so maybe maybe there's not gonna be much for me to do here, we'll see. Demo Man is really good at long range damage, hit people from far away. That's basically what I'm gonna try to do. Your primary weapon is actually not your pipes, it's your stickies. Your stickies, uh, you can charge up your sticky launcher to shoot the stickies a little bit farther. And so, rather than sacrifice my position to left click, right click, left click, right click as fast as I can, I'm actually going to stand a little bit further back and charge my stickies up to get that little bit of extra range. So one thing you're doing when you're playing Demo Man for the first time is just kind of learning how long you need to charge your stickies for in order to get that range that you want. Okay, Chris Krieg on the Demo Man, that's good. Only one kill though. And good damage here. I see them right around the corner, so I'm going to throw some pipes in. And we got a couple kills. Pretty nice. Now, I only use my pills in close quarters combat. So if, in a little bit, if I'm a little bit in that situation where I'm right up against a choke point and I need to do some immediate damage, I will throw in the, uh, the, the pipes. But for the most part, I'm kind of just standing back here and I'm really aiming for, you know, 40 to 60 damage stickies. If I'm really doing well, I'm gonna hit a primo 70 damage sticky. But if I'm hitting 50 damage on the stickies, that's pretty good. You want the sticky to basically land on top of someone's face and then right click for maximum damage. And that's gonna be a quick round, so not much commentary there for a pretty, pretty quick start to this game. All right, I had to mess with my recording settings, so there's a little bit of a miscontinuity in the video. But that's okay, we just got back into the game and on defense. And I think where I left off was talking about how I'm charging on my stickies. And there's a Chris Krieg here, okay. Kind of unfortunate on the timing because there's really nothing here. Try to hit the spy randomly, not gonna get it. Unfortunate that the medic that was healing me just kind of guessed at the sticky timing. But it is what it is. Making sure my recording software is working. All right. Shooting some stickies over the top. Oh my god. Big damage there. Peek left. See if I can find anything. Are there invisible players here that I can't see? There were invisible players that I can't see. Okay. So I'm going to record a demo. Stop. Forward. ASDF. Now I should be able to see everybody again. It's uh, like a weird bug. All right, getting all these weird video glitches on my recording. Nice kills on the pyro. As the demo man, you do the most damage out of any class in the game. So I have so much damage potential, but the main problem is that I can't really engage in close quarters combat. So I have to be hitting from range. And oftentimes there's nothing there. You know, it's just you're, you're setting back at range. Hoping you can aim and hit that, but it's hard. Eh. 
Kind of, I'm kind of pre-firing like spots that I think they're gonna come in. I could be setting up traps as well and then throwing pipes down. That's another thing I could be doing instead. But just kind of trying to prove a point here by using my stickies a lot. I would say in terms of stickies to pipes ratio, you'd be wanting to use your stickies. 60-70% eh, of the time. Like, mostly stickies, basically. And then use your pipes, you know, in there. Like, if I'm back here like this and I need to spam a spot, I'll just, like, throw some pipes out. But most of the time, I've got my stickies out and I'm trying to hit, you know, this pyro at 60 damage at range like this. You notice I'm kind of just, like, left-click, right-clicking, and if it's not hitting, I'm just wasting a lot of ammo. And... The downside of demo is that you have this really long reload time for your two primary weapons. There we go. Uh, that's pretty good. Good damage. I need some ammo though. We'll just throw some pipes while we wait for it to spawn. I can reload. Oh, did he take it? I think he did. Ammo is tough to come by right now. Let's see. Got some over here. Got some ammo now. Spy close. Nice. You might notice that I have ragdolls turned off. And that's a graphics config setting that you can do. And it kind of cleans up your screen so that there's not so much you know distracting ragdolls jumping around. You know, juggle that demo in the air while he's Ubered, so the Uber is a little bit less effective. Backing off, setting a trap behind him so he can't back out. I'm in a really bad spot right now. I basically he crits me when I had not not the right things loaded and I was covered under a roof, so my my arcing shots were just not able to be well positioned. It's hard in pubs because there's not a lot of communication. So you're kinda guessing when each other want the crits. I'm just going to go back here and grab some more ammo. Right now we're 14 kills and 0 deaths, so... Pretty solid. Good damage. Grab some more ammo here. It's really low on ammo. But I have been spamming a lot. So you can see that, like, when you're playing this game, and whether no matter what class you're playing, but especially on demo, like, you really don't need to be super aggressive in order to get kills and do well. It's really about, you know, playing back, chilling, shooting some damage out, but really not overextending yourself to a place where, like, you have to, like, make something happen. Like, I'm not even, I got the crits creek, and I'm not even, like, pushing up that aggressively. Oh my god, that was lucky. Like, okay, this one, they just had their backs turned to me, so it's like, go, go farm that stuff. But I'm not really, like, super tryhard pushing up and getting up in their face, because... I don't need to do that. You can really just chill back and they're going to come to you. And especially when I'm on Demo Man on defense, like, it's so chill. Like, I don't need to push up into them in order to make that combat happen. Just having good distancing, good positioning. It's very consistent. Got that 22 kills, zero deaths. Let's go.